Hey everyone, so if at any point in the video you enjoy what you see, make sure to leave a like and subscribe with the post notifications on. But all that aside, I hope you enjoy the video. Hey, what's up? So it's spring break right now and you're probably wondering, Eric, why are you in your college dorm room if it's spring break and you should be on vacation in Florida or something like that? And the answer to that question is I, I'm really poor and, and I couldn't really afford to go anywhere. So I'm stuck here. I'm literally the only one on campus right now. And to be honest with you, I can only stay in this dorm room for so long. Believe it or not, I actually need to go outside sometimes. It doesn't happen that often, but sometimes I actually need to leave my room. And I was thinking, well, before I die of boredom, what is there for me to do? So I went online and looked up things to do in Chicago and saw that there's a Chicago Bulls game tomorrow. And I've never actually been to a Chicago Bulls game, so I thought it might be kind of fun. And then I was also thinking, you people really enjoy the videos where I go out in public and talk to a camera and embarrass myself. So I was like, well, why don't I combine those two things and make a vlog of me going to my first ever Chicago Bulls game. So that's what we're gonna do in today's video. Now the first thing we need to do is buy tickets. Hopefully there are still tickets left. I would imagine there are because the Bulls are really bad and, and no one goes to their games. So here I am on Ticketmaster.com. This isn't a sponsored video by the way, but this is the only place I can get tickets. What? All right, Jake Pauler, so it looks like we have some pretty bad news. I tried to buy tickets on Ticketmaster, and um, it's not letting me. So I went on Twitter to see if other people were having problems with Ticketmaster, and apparently everybody is. Apparently BTS, which I think is like a K-pop group, I, I don't know, please, please don't hurt me if you like them, I'm sorry. But apparently BTS released like shows or something, and like everyone like crashed the website. So now if I want to buy Chicago Bulls tickets, uh, I can't. So since Ticketmaster isn't really working out, I guess I'm gonna have to go on StubHub and see if anyone else is reselling their tickets because as I said, the Bulls are pretty bad. So I would imagine a lot of people are selling their tickets because they just don't want to go. So I went on StubHub to see if I could find the cheapest seats and uh, I found this really bad seat for $30. But since it's only $30, I, I have to sit there because I can't afford to get actual good seats. I don't even know if I have a StubHub account, but I'm gonna just type in my email and my regular password that I use and see if I have one. It's probably a bad idea that I use the same password for almost everything because apparently you're not supposed to do that. All right, so I had to create an account because apparently I didn't have one before. And I'm gonna put in my debit card details. I'm not gonna show you that because I don't want you to steal my money. I, I don't have a lot of money in the first place, but the money I do have, I I'd kind of like to keep it. Okay, so I just bought them and now they're not showing up. So hopefully I didn't get scammed. Hopefully it just takes a little bit, I'm hoping, um, because if not, I just lost $40 and that's like half my bank account so um all right, so it's been a couple hours and I just checked and uh, it looks like my tickets are ready to print, but I'm too lazy to go downstairs and uh, go to the printer. So I'm probably gonna print it tomorrow morning and I'm really tired, so I'm probably gonna go to bed. All right, what's up? So it's the next day, I just took a shower. I'm shirtless right now, so I should probably put a shirt on because you probably don't, don't wanna see me without a shirt on. But since the Bulls colors are red, I am putting on a red t-shirt. Yes, it's for the wrong team, it's for a baseball team, but but still, it's the right color. All right, hey, sorry about my hair. I know I look like one of those TikTok kids, so I'm sorry, I'm just too lazy to comb it. But right now, I'm gonna like put my jacket on, take all the stuff I need, then I'm gonna go downstairs and then print my ticket, and then we're gonna go to the game. All right, so I just printed out my ticket. Uh, here it is here. So apparently the person who sold me this ticket, their name is Stacy, so uh, that's cool. the main bulk of the trip that was like 40 minutes now it's probably going to be like 10 or 15 minutes on the blue line go to the blue blue line you have to go through this thingy and so i just got on the wrong train and then i was like wait a minute i'm not supposed to go that way so i had to get off so now i'm waiting for the train to forest park which is the direction i want to go i was gonna go to o'hare but that's where the airport is um so i almost went the wrong way but i need to go here Alright, 
so I just got off the stop. Apparently it's an 11 minute walk and I don't really know where to go. Like I literally have no idea where I am. But if you look over here, you got a nice little view of some of the skyline. So that's kind of cool, I guess. But I'm gonna just walk this direction. Hopefully I'm going the right way. I I'm probably not. So I'm walking through this tunnel and hopefully I'm going the right direction. But I see a few other people walking this way, so I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way. So apparently the gates don't open for another like 10 minutes, so they're making us all wait outside. They left the door open, so I tried to walk in there and pretend like I was like a worker and that I belong there, but they kind of yelled at me. Alright, so I just got here. They also have like a promo day or something, so everyone got like a free basketball, so that's kind of cool, I guess. So I just bought a shirt so I can fit in like everyone else and not look like a loser. So now I'm gonna change into that. Right now I'm trying to find my seats. I'm like on the third floor and I don't know where the stairs are, so I don't know where I'm going. And now they're playing copyrighted music, so please don't copyright me, YouTube. Alright, so I just got to my seat and I probably have the record for like the worst seat of all time. There are only two more rows that are higher than mine. This is my row and then those are the two highest rows. Also, apparently they're playing the Atlanta Hawks and both the Bulls and the Hawks are like really bad. So I'd be surprised if there were a lot of people here. Right now there's not really too many people because both teams are just awful. But I got here like an hour early. I already ate my food. So I'm going to just kind of chill out and wait for game time.